Get back to Mondays with Mata. We are here today with Kurt Vogel, and he is here to tell us about the importance of using our voice, making a difference, and giving public testimony. So, we are all excited to see Kurt today. So, let's get started with Mondays with Mata. Okay guys, we are here with Kurt. Welcome to the show, Kurt. Thank you for hosting me. You're welcome. So welcome to the show and let's get started with our questions. Okay, so our first question is, um, how did you get interested in policy advocacy? I was involved with a program two years ago that was focused around self-advocacy and then also I had the opportunity to testify in front of the Senate Judiciary Committee. That was how I got in that was how I got interested in advocacy. Okay, very good. Okay. Um so, Kurt, you did public testimony. So, what was it like to give public testimony? When I gave public testimony, it made me realize the strength of my own voice and how I want to help encourage everyone to be able to use their own, that their own voice is the, on, is the only strengths that they need to help advocate for themselves. Very good cut. Why is it important for our lawmakers to cut out the R word? It's important for the R word to be moved from all Georgia legislation and code because I, for me, I do not feel like that's a very respectful or dignifying way to describe people with disability to describe people who have intellectual and developmental disabilities. Okay, thank you. All right, so our next question is, um, you have made a lot of differences. So um, how does it lead to make a difference around, um, around public testimony? I feel like I made a difference. I have made a difference. And everyone's life in Georgia by knowing that I was able to help get some, get, remove the R word from Georgia legislation and code and also something that I think is important to remember that it can be even just small changes like removing the R word. It doesn't have to be, it doesn't have to be any big change. It, most of the time change happens by small changes. That's a very good. Uh, okay, so how do you um, encourage other people to do what you did in the Capitol when you gave public testimony? I feel like the best, the best way for others to stay involved is to stay informed about what is going on in their local community and then also what is going on in their state that way they can reach out to their legislators when there is something that they want to when something arises that is important to them Okay, thank you, Kurt, for coming on to Mondays with Martha and advocating. I think that you're doing a really great job. Thank you for having me. Okay, thank you for watching Mondays with Martha. Please remember to subscribe down below and press the on Twitter or Facebook to make sure all viewers can see. For viewers like you, thank you for watching Mondays with Martha.